Hello friends, welcome to DP Tutorials. In this tutorial, let us learn how to use the dissolve feature in Primavera P6. As part of project scheduling, you might be feeling that some activities are no longer required when there is a change in the scope of work. Some users simply delete the unwanted activities, but by doing that, the relationships will also be removed and the linked activities will then become open-ended, which is not recommended. So in this video, I will show you how to use the dissolve activities feature, which allows us to remove activities and bridge the gap in the logic. Let's take a sample project and see how this works now. I'm creating a sample project now. Open this project and let me add activities A, one more activity and name it as B, one more activity and call it as C. So I'm taking these three activities in this example and now link all these activities by default, right clicking and select these link activities, which gives the finish to start relationship between these activities. Now give durations as 30 days for these three activities and then schedule this project. You can use the F9 shortcut. Now you will see the Gantt chart like this showing the relationships as well. Now suppose, assume that if you want to nullify the activity B from the schedule because of some changes in the project. If we directly delete the activity B, see that the relationships will be broken from activity A and activity C. Right click and select delete. You can see that the relationships has been removed from activity A and C, which is not a good practice and not recommended at all. So let us now use the dissolve feature. Focus on finish date of activity A, which is 20th March and activity C start date is 4th May. Now let us dissolve the activity B by right clicking and selecting dissolve option. Click yes to confirm and then schedule the project to see the revised start date of C as 23rd March, which is just after the end date of activity A. That means our logic has been bridged properly without any gap. Got it friends? That's very easy and awesome, right? So friends, in this way, you should be using the Dissolve Activities feature in Primavera P6. If you have enjoyed this tutorial, please give me a like, share and comment. For further more interesting videos, please do subscribe DP Tutorials. Thank you friends. Thanks for watching.